We just defeated an ancient Hindu god, and now Zelda. 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 Sex chase. Sex chase. Sex. Chase. Sex. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Skyward strike this, and then I'll skyward strike some princess pussy. <laughs> Way to start the episode. <laughs> uh, Holy ah, shit! Green flame is green. the hottest flame, I think. I don't know. I think blue it's is. It's gotta be pretty yeah, hot. I think blue is the hottest. No, it's not. Green's hotter. Do you really know? I don't know. <laughs> White is hottest. <clears throat> What's going on here? Ah! Whoa. Um. Uh. You okay, Fee? <laughs> Yeah, dude. Uh, yeah. Oh, oh fuck. So Raise your sword, master. You're friggin' weird. Okay. <laughs> oh, this is the flame we wanted. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> I remember Pretty what we were silly. looking for. Pew, pew, pew. Fuck yeah, magic sword. <gasps> can we shoot? Can we shoot it? No. <laughs> Flame shooting powers, or you know, like. Oh. Oh. Look at it! Improves your sword, making it longer and sharp enough yes. to do twice yes. as much damage. Yes. Yeah. Bam, boom, bam, boom, 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 boom. <laughs> <laughs> boom, ba, 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 boom, ba, ba, ba. <laughs> bamboo. Bamboo. Oh, bamboo <laughs> thing. Oh, that was just your onomatopoeia of how to use a sword. Bamboo, bamboo, bamboo. Uh. Got you back, guys! What? What's wrong with his hand? It's shaky. <gasps> oh! Yeah! Yes! Has that been in previous Zeldas? That yeah. is so cool! OTT? O O T? I mean? Uh. Yep, yep. The Sacred Flame has purified your blade, enhancing and evolving it. Ooh. With your sword now enhanced, you're ready to learn the new melody. We should return to the Isle of Songs. Bamboo, bamboo. <laughs> Save. <laughs> Ocarina of Time had it. Yeah. What? <laughs> what did I just do there? Oh, oh fuck. Ah, uh, the sword you're carrying is different since I last saw you. Uh, <laughs> yes, I see it as much improved. Think the goddess chosen hero was a mere boy. Quite a twist. <laughs> I like the new voice. Chosen hero or not, you do not, not yet possess the strength required to wield the full power of that blade. You must train yourself further. Uh, devote yourself wholly to this task. Oh. Farewell, boy. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Uh, we can. Ta da! I think that's it for this episode then. Uh, and next episode we'll start off at the Isle of Song and learn a new song. And um, oh, we got to. There's a bird over there, so we'll save over there. Ah oh, shit. Lol, fart. <laughs> right? Yeah. Farts are funny because they come out of your butt. That was a, a really funny one. Bones. According to lore, every single Link had it. <coughs> oh yeah, I think that I could make it out during uh, um, Link to the Past on his hand there. Really? Yeah. Could you make that you out? You couldn't in the... I just like how, how uh, when franchises retroactively write lore and be like, Oh yeah, we had that plan the whole He's time. He's always been there. <laughs> <laughs> you just couldn't see it because of the limitations of the console at the time. But he had it on his hand. <laughs> Um, or that they just officially released a Zelda timeline, and <laughs> everyone's like, oh, it's official now! But they don't, like, they released a little graphic that shows them, uh -huh. and it shows branches because apparently Ocarina of Time, and I know this spoils, but it's too late now, uh, Ocarina of Time creates three different timelines, so they actually have the games sorted into the three different timelines. Oh, really? And, yeah, that's nice. That's all well and good, and they made it official so all the nerds should be happy, but they didn't explain any inconsistencies. Mm. There's so many inconsistencies that make that timeline impossible, 
because they Paradoxes. made mistakes. <laughs> yeah, they made mistakes in, in the writing of Zelda in the past because they never had an official timeline in mind, but they've retroactively made one and they didn't tie any of those loose ends. They just said, here's your graphic, there you go, there that's is. the official one. And uh, if it doesn't make it. sense, um, a wizard did it. <laughs> oh, hey, get that, get that. All right. Can you play your um, thingy here? Yes. Nice work. For example, Fraser? I don't know examples. I don't know enough about Zelda. I just read a bunch of people's articles that said that it had tons of loose ends that weren't tied up. I'm not an authority on Zelda. Did you want to spend some of the rupees or give Deacon some more stamina potion or do the bamboo no. game? No, we're done today. Done? We're done. We'll okay. do that, then maybe we'll start the next episode. Maybe With we'll switch it up and we'll do some skylofting. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Um... In every timeline they've ever given, they've mentioned that it doesn't perfectly fit because they didn't care about a perfect match. They're <laughs> focusing on each game one by one. <laughs> See, even Nintendo can at least admit that they didn't they didn't have one. Yeah. That they didn't do it. Alright. The good thing about Zelda games though is at least the franchise each game actually has some sort of link, like correlation. Literally link. Uh, but unlike Final Fantasy, where, like, the only things that correlate the storylines is just, like, oh, they got chocobos. <laughs> you know? But otherwise, nothing has anything to do with the other stories. Uh, I think we're done. Alright, so, you know, just fill up the last few minutes of me trolling people, <laughs> pissing people off, because I'm talking about stuff that I barely know about, but, no, just enough about to piss people off. <laughs> You know, just enough about it to bash it. Yeah, <laughs> just enough to, to make some bold, broad, sweeping, sweeping statements. Sweeping statements. <laughs> <laughs> that people will take extremely seriously. <laughs> you know what's funny about uh, specifically, um, you know, the most famous of all the titles that we've done that with, that I've done that with, uh, Sonic. Uh, I had somebody last night when I posted a thing saying, what are you most excited about coming out this year? People said Sonic 4, second chapter or whatever. The one that everybody said, like, the physics on it sucked. Uh -huh. uh, it was a downloadable one, a DLC. Um, and, uh, anyways, he said, it's going to be better. They say they're using a better physics engine, and uh, Tails is going to be in it. And please play it, but don't make fun of it, and be a jerk, and make all these tired jokes that nobody cares <laughs> about, like, furry jokes, and because uh, it's just stupid, and it's annoying, and <laughs> please play this game, because it's going to be awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, Sonic fans. Seriously. They're the, they're the most, like, angry, uppity fans. Because oh. they, they chose the losing team. They chose the losing team growing up, and now they're pissed off about it. Oh, that's harsh. It's true! They're just like, like oh. Uh, when, when everybody was, uh, like, deciding Nintendo or Sega, they went with yeah. Sega, Sonic the Hedgehog, and now they well, look like fools. Yeah, and you and look I, like, was a mistake. and it eats me up inside. <laughs> it tears me up inside. Tears me up inside. <laughs> I feel like I can still appreciate, but still laugh at Sonic. Um, and I love, like, other games. Sonic was such, like so cool. Mario. Sonic was so cool back in the day. And then it's just one yeah, of the most totally. brutalized franchises by its creators, by its rights owner. Holders. There, you didn't even have to fill in your own trolling chat. You... You did it. I did it for you. You did it. <laughs> <laughs> and the, it's funny because for as, as ravenous as they are for their franchise and defensive of it, they are the most, like, vindictive Critical. and hard to please out of all of them. Like, you know, we get a new Mario game. We're like, sweet, Mario. Oh, yeah. look what he's doing now. He's such an asshole and stuff <laughs> like that, you know, like, uh, or... <laughs> But but when they get a new game, they get so pissed. They're like, "That's not the way Sonic should act, and Sonic's voice is wrong. It should always be Jaleel White." <laughs> like, <laughs> uh. Sonic didn't have the right ratio of attitude to batitude. <laughs> What's a Sonic? They're not that bad. Yes, they are. You know they are. You know. 
And it's too bad that it makes all the normal Sonic fans, like, say, Becky, get lumped in with them. People who just liked them growing up and now hear, like, people bashing Sonic and then get probably defensive and turn into defensive Sonic fans. No, like, I think I'm pretty <laughs> level-headed about it. We'll see. <laughs> Why not have Sonic chat at the end of a Zelda playthrough? Yeah, makes perfect sense. <laughs> <laughs> I just felt like I didn't get enough trolling in that uh, Yeah, didn't feel like episode, you quite so. hit your mark. Dude, whenever we play next time, you should whip some things, like whip the bird statue and whip that little guy. We should remember that. Do, do right now. What? Oh, see, dude, do a strike with your sword. Who? This guy? No, like, uh, see if what you shoot with your sword, how more powerful it is. Oh, yeah, let's try that out. With this guy. Oh! What's he gonna say? <laughs> That's it. Oh. Wow. 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 Uh, and what? Oh yeah, my sword, eh? Yeah, I don't think it does anything. It's just bigger. Does it feel bigger? <laughs> In my hand, it does. Yeah. It's got a new girth. Let me see. Mm. <laughs> Do you want it? Yeah. <laughs> it's pretty good. Whoa. There you go. Do you like it? Woo yeah, woo. woo. <laughs> uh. I think Skyward Swords are, or Skyward Strikes are supposed to be the laser beams that you've yeah. had in previous Zelda yeah. Switch. Yeah, that's alright, I guess. I just hate that it ha yeah, you have to charge it up every time. I want the old days where you're like, <laughs> That sound it made? Yeah, that was, a, that was a pretty good sound, actually. TF2 time? Yeah, I can jump in TF2 for a bit. I'll meet you in there, Turbos. All right, this has been Skyward Sword on Video Games Awesome Live. It continues. We've got to be just past the halfway mark now, so. Yeah, I think so. Keep on keeping on with our long haul. Thanks for watching, everybody, and good night.